excites you about the start of every season? Uh, just to go out and perform, right? Make big plays, uh, be out there with my teammates. You know I mean, having fun with the game we love. I know we talk in training camp about just the comfort level with the offense, but the comfort level with Vernon. How do you see this offense now that you've had all the training camp, all the offseason? How do you see this offense coming together and how maybe lethal it could be? Uh, well, I mean, we know it can be very lethal. Vernon has a ton of talent around him, I mean, to help him flourish, right? So it's going to be so fun to just obviously go out there and help him as much as we can, right? And uh, whenever anything goes wrong, we can – I know our, in the receiver room, we the standard is, is super high, right? So we go out there with, with that little chip just to, to show everybody that we can do it with whoever's back there. Lucky, is he different than the player that we saw last year? I know he crammed the playbook as much as he could. He went 4-2 when, when, when Nathan wasn't here, but have you seen a different Vernon Adams Jr.? So what have you noticed? For sure. Uh, he's more vocal. Definitely that, that leader now, right? He's more comfortable and has that confidence. It's tough when you when you come in in that quarterback, especially after having this success in Montreal, right? And how that ended and him coming over here and have to take over, you know, offense that was hitting on all cylinders. Uh, but I think he's, he's, he's grown a lot, you know what I mean? Just because he's had that time to sit in there and learn the playbook, learn the offense. And now it's not like, hey, where's everyone gonna be at? He knows where I'm at, like he knows where everyone is. So now he's be able to just play, play his way. Anything special planned if you hit the end zone in Calgary on Thursday because you're heading to Rodeo Town? <laughs> yeah, we usually uh, prep touchdown celebrations on day three. So tomorrow, we, <laughs> if you come hang out, you might see something. <laughs> just, you guys are always laughing, joking, having fun. Even when you lose, you're still doing it. Absolutely. So people shouldn't interpret that as the fact that you don't care about losing it. What is it about that, that? Is that just part of making you guys successful? Win or lose is just having that fun and that. Not for sure. Uh, I mean, we know kind of hard work we put in, day in and day out, right? We, but we obviously joke. You don't want to go out there all tense, right? At the win or or, or loss. Um, and obviously, everyone knows for myself, I like to, I like to live free and, and loose myself. So like I tell them, tell them boys, man, let's have fun, right? All the time. And uh, I mean, it comes with the game, right? If you can go undefeated, kudos to you, right? But it comes with it, and those losses 